Hi there. My name is Hugo Berensen, Account Manager of Supply Chain Media. And we have a message from you from Budapest. I am here on Translog Connect together with my colleague Marike Lenstra, editor and trend watcher, and she will interview some interesting people. So, Marike, what can we expect? Uh, thank you for the introduction, Hugo. Let's go to the exhibition floor and ask the exhibitors about the trends they see in the market, how these trends impact companies, and what kind of solutions they have to help their customers face these challenges. Nowadays, that the customers are looking for uh, complex solutions on the market. It's not enough to take the shipment from A to B. They are looking for quite complex solution, uh, transportation, uh, warehousing, track and trace solutions, custom clearance, and etc. And definitely, we see that the market of uh, of uh, trucks availability flipped, with uh, higher demand for trucks and with uh, limited ability uh, for trackers to, to follow up with the growth of the demand. We can see that uh, supply chain process, uh, it's not an easy one process anymore. But now we see it as a complicated planning process, how to deliver the goods on exact uh, delivery time. So it means that uh, information flow or information in a real time, this is what needs to be provided to the customer. Well, the two main trends we have uh, heard of and we discussed about are cost reduction and activity optimization. Uh, cost reduction is usually, it comes from the market pressure. They get the market pressure from the consumer and then from their vendors and then to the, to the people who handle, for the shippers uh, or the people who handle their logistics. And the second one is uh, activity optimization because they cannot do the things the old fashioned way anymore. So phone calls, emails, these help, but they're not effective as automation. Yeah, we have to be very flexible and, and make unique tailor-made solutions for our customers. Uh, we, we cannot sell a box and, and only what is inside the box, but we have to think outside the box as well. Yeah, so obviously uh, shippers might have challenges these days to, to make sure that their goods can uh, travel to uh, their receivers and, uh, and to realize the sales. The driver shortage. So market is missing uh, about 100,000 drivers currently. It's very tricky to cut down the cost because uh, you have to be very, very careful where you cost, uh, cut the cost from. Uh, you, can, uh, you can risk cutting some cost and say you save some money, but you lose on the other side, in the selling side. On the optimization of the activity, you need to be very careful how you uh, do your change management and how you sell internally your, uh, your solution because it could be disruptive in your workforce and yeah our customers have the possibility for a one stop shopping we we shop uh, all all these uh, uh, services uh, at dsv you can buy transportation custom clearance rnc transportation road transportation warehousing everything so we can offer a, a tailor-made solution for the customers. So C.H. Robinson is uh, delivering to, to its customers firm uh, capacity availability strategies. Uh, so we, with power of flexibility, we make sure that we can arrange and, and contract enough tracks that we can ship the goods of our customers to their receivers. We have a better um, everyday program, which is uh, based on a lean management. So we are optimizing daily processes. Uh, we are utilizing our fleets as much as possible. Uh, and additionally, uh, where it's possible, we are also offering um, uh, intermodal solution for our customers. We have the transport solution, which uh, is the, also the name of the division. Uh, we offer a cloud-based TMS for shippers in order to uh, effectively source their carriers, to plan their transport activities, to follow the execution, uh, to manage their costs, and to have a possibility to analyze their data as a result of this activity. This was our supply chain message from Budapest. Hopefully you enjoyed watching this video and we would like to see you next time.